eight characters. And like, he made a name for himself very early on in Ultimate with Falco, but that was also accompanied by other characters. Oh, it's no! It's All right, well, uh, about starting off in entertaining That's fashion. rather unfortunate. We'll flesh to the other side. <laughs> we gotta go. My people need me. <laughs> Save the world. <laughs> All right. Bowser's well, starting to rack up this damage. And bow. Up till we're down entering, air. We're entering the cutscene. We have exited the cutscene. This is a quick time event. What are you on about? <laughs> <laughs> if you didn't press B <laughs> at the right time, you messed up. I feel like... <laughs> Falco is like playing Metal Gear Solid 4. Just as a cutscene every five seconds. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm not wrong. I feel like that's just fighting Kofi. That's also true. The way that I love to describe fighting Kofi is that the first time you're in a Kofi combo, it's like a Kingdom Hearts cutscene. <laughs> you have to sit there the entire length. And try to you figure out what's happening in it. Second time you get hit by it, you're allowed to SDI. You're allowed to exit early. Nonetheless, things not looking too it's great. It's not a good start for Val. I'm not going to sugarcoat it. Uh, he doesn't even hold his hand. He knows he done goofed. Although Kofi did not have to do him like that. That, that was, that was like... disgusting. Yo, what is with these matches we're getting on stream? Where, like, we got some poor innocent sod getting roasted immediately. And these two, no I didn't remorse. expect it to go like this. Uh, to be fair, no one expected Bow to, to wolf side B. Like, <laughs> yeah, I gotta go. <laughs> oh no, I don't want to watch this anymore. <laughs> <laughs> it's just not about it. All right, here we go on to game number two. Here you go, Wolf, Act Two. Uh, <laughs> For realsies this time, hopefully. Yeah, actual Wolf. Cross his fingers. So that was a that was a great button check, right, guys? Oh no. <laughs> That was a button check. Why, why is there a one near Falco? Oh, no. <laughs> what was that? Just let the man rock. This is just a lot of noise coming out of Falco at once. Falco is another one of those characters who just likes to talk. Like him and Greninja. Like also, even though Wolf doesn't talk as much, he makes a ton of noise. He's a grunt. He's a grunty boy. It's not even the grunts. It's the, the, the chingly chings of his chains. And I don't really know what else could possibly be making noise. But His metal pleading, I guess. He's got some metal on him, right? His dash attack, the young coin purse. It just makes so much noise every it time does. he speaks. He dash attacks. Wolf dash attack. I love that move. Oh, Ooh. all right. Wave land on the platform. Yeah, of course. <laughs> <laughs> My favorite. Listen, if everybody knows that it's a problem, we could solve it together. What are you on about? This is, this is Smash. We're not going to solve anything. <laughs> now hold on just a minute. Ooh, I like that down smash. But Kofi's able to catch him there. Yeah, the down smash doesn't slash that high. They're big claws, but they're not that big. Catch is pretty high, though, sometimes. It does, but, like... But not that high. Yeah. Just, just trying to fare at him. Just Yo, but the fare is working, we, so... We like, just gotta swipe at him, and eventually he'll drop shield. Somewhere in Bow's Bones, I know Ooh. he wanted down there. You know, I feel like this is a good time to bring up that I believe their set count is 1-0 Bow Fader. At Collision, but, right? Yes, yeah. at Collision. Right? Fresh out of pools, Bow had defeated Kofi. So, I remember that happening, and I was just like, very rarely do these two like intersect in bracket. Mostly because like Long Island and Staten Island are fairly far from each other. Yeah, you know, we don't get a lot of crossover between the uh, the two scenes. So, technically, this is the run back. The run back like what eight months in the making? Uh, <laughs> almost a year. Yeah, like it's, it's it's been quite more a like, time. More like three fourths of a year, but yeah, it's, it's, it's been a while. Yeah, I don't think they played anywhere else. I'm trying to think what other events the two of them were at together. I mean, when some of you find folks to Google that for us. Double check our fun facts. See if they're as fun as we like. Could I know they were both because that was definitely not fun. Ooh. I know they were both at uh, Paramount, but I don't think they played each other. No, I remember because Bo lost to uh, to Wes. Yeah, it was Wes. 
All right. Time to go in the cutscene? No. No. Like I said, it's a Kingdom Hearts cutscene. You're able to skip it after the first time. Final mix. <laughs> King Mickey. King Mickey out in this. Ooh, down tilt. Ooh. It's a pretty favorable position for uh, for battle, all things considered. Yeah. Like, I wouldn't be surprised if he manages to clutch this into a game three situation. Yeah, big turnaround after that first stock of the first game. I, it was, there was only going up after that, to be honest with you. Oh. Like, once right. again, Falco Illusion puts him too high. If Kofi does land this up tilt, though, I'm pretty sure it's over, but we're not going to get a chance to land Ooh. instead. Oh, game smash, three. A lot of I love that victory. That's a good. I. That's a. We're just good. weaklings, all of us. A lot of you. It's so good. I like how he says a lot of you in a one-on-one -on -one match. Just one person. I mean, he could be <laughs> saying it to multiple. Like if right. it was in dubs, it make a bit of sense. Yeah. All right, where are we going, Kalos? Okay. All right. Could we put him back on his headphones? We're sticking bird. Yeah. Like I said, I didn't expect them to switch their characters, even though, like, they do have other characters. I'm not going to bother listing Kofi's at this point in time, but, like... I think he's I down to three. No, I could see him switching to... I have seen him play Isabel in brackets. I haven't seen him play Isabel in a hot minute. I forgot he had an Isabel. That, that's a squad strike only character. For that's him. a character that put him on the map. Crazy, I'm saying that. And he has been playing a lot more chic lately. That's right. He was These characters might seem yeah, random, yeah, yeah. but I promise you that they exist. All that being said, I really think that like, Kofi needs to just stick on Falco for at least for finding Val. Yeah. Both of them just throwing aerials out, trying to get the other one to do something. I mean, it's working for Val. Oh, oh. he almost got the back hit. Do we down right. it? Oh no, oh, we're, no we're just we're safe. We're back. And here Don't worry about me, fam. We back. The Kalos pick is just so smart every time. Trying to get him with the forward tilt at the ledge. Like, Wolf is only able to cover so many options on the stage for Falco because he has such a good wall jump. Yeah. And his single jump covers so much space as it stands, so it's like... With the down air and the up tilt. Not able to complete the cutscene. We hit the No, we're button. going to a new one. This is, a, this is like a choose-your-own-adventure. <laughs> we're playing Telltale games. The Walking Dead Season 4. Mm. Featuring Cal Kofi. Tate. <laughs> <laughs> you pitched the wrong option. <laughs> and with all the noise that that dash attack makes. Where oh, are you? Oh, you're, you're chilling. You, you eat some damage for it, but you're chilling. Yeah, hit with the back hit of the down smash. Fair back air. I like it. Able to get a lot of damage off there. <laughs> <laughs> Again, did the he wall buffer jump, the up? <laughs> the wall jump's just so good. That was a big mix, and then he just upbeat afterwards. It's like... Fair? You're crazy. I love He's it. He's big crazy. With all the rage that's on him, I don't think that would have worked. Although, put him in a lower, like, percentage, he may have. I mean, Either he way, he's playing it great. He didn't get hit for it, so... Tall ceiling coming to bite Kofi in the end. Dash attack. Another one. This time we're gonna grab and put him off stage. All right, all right, we're gonna lose him back. Oh, up smash! You know it's a valid option. It's it just, is. You, you don't often get a chance to see it because it's such an it has such an awkward uh, first hit. It's similar to to Falcons, but like it's not as long because he's got stubby bird legs with hollow yeah. bones. Oh, no, in this version, aren't they just boots? Well, birds have hollow bones. Oh, okay. That's just a bird thing. Why are you pervious to that information? I like birds. Okay. You say this with every bird fun fact I drop. That's true. I forget you like birds. This bird, though, is on his last life. So yeah. If you like this bird, you're going to uh, you have to cheer him on a little bit. Sitting at middling percentages, and he's trying to net off the stock with Bo, but Bo's just done such a fine job being able to box out Kofi, like, get the damage where it counts, and make sure that he's not close enough for Kofi to, like, get any type of reversal on a mess-up. Yeah. 
Uh, Kofi's starting to play a lot more patiently now, just waiting for something like that. Yep, wait for the awkward approach, watch it not work, and then just kill because of it. Yeah. And he's even up things pretty quickly here. Kofi's patient play terrifies me. It's very scary. Cause like He's just willing to sit there and wait for you to do something. He doesn't like to, and he doesn't do, do it too often, but if Kofi tries to camp you out, he is golden patience, and his reactions are just phenomenal. Yeah, and he's taking the lead here, percent-wise. Fair, not quite like enough to He's do. managing to claw this match back, and I feel like... Tinker at the ledge? No, nah, that's he's missed that a couple of times now, and Kofi's made him pay the price every single time. Trying to pressure here with the forward tilt. That's so... This is a scary position. Oh, he's got the laser, but it misses the down air. He's not able to kill. All right. Ooh. This could right. be the situation Getting about damage. needs. Look at that damage out of three hits, but he misses yeah. just barely, and Kofi takes the set over Bao. Very close set. A very close one indeed that started off on really rough waters, but I feel like Bao managed to salvage the set. I feel he like definitely it, did. It got really competitive. It was a very clean set towards the end of it. And honestly, outside of the beginning, I feel like Bao played it out well. The fact that he was able to like still come back from that beat, Super tilting start. Yeah, that after that start, I was like, Ugh. but no, he definitely brought it back, keeping it close all the way up to the end, taking game two. Oh, well, definitely a uh, a fine member of the hashtag, not just a commentator. And he immediately goes back to gooning outside. Of course, <laughs> of course, <laughs> you already know how it is. You can't see it because we are in a uh, isolated We're chamber. We're in the booth. We're in the booth. Um, but behind the booth is Devin. Is, is actually Hi, Devin. Devin. And then behind us and behind Devin is like 